More Roblox games based on funerals. You may be surprised, but there's thousands upon thousands of funeral games found on Roblox. Some of them are just jokes, but some funerals are actually dedicated to real people's dogs, cats, and even well-known people from the Roblox community. I'm going to take a look at different Roblox funerals and find out more information on why the game was made in the first place, because there's some pretty interesting ones out there. So yeah, take a look. If I just type in funeral, I get like so many different ones out here. This one looks pretty interesting. It's a uh, Ubu Cute Singles Funeral. Yeah, she's uh, she's the Roblox YouTuber. YouTuber. Hey, what do we got here? It's uh, it's pretty spooky. Yo, look, that's her gravestone. 2022-2023. Wow, she was only one year old. <laughs> I like how the grippers are censored as well as like her icon having like a slash on it. So this funeral was made after Ubu Cute Singles YouTube account got banned. Or at least that's what a lot of people thought. Yeah, a lot of people made videos thinking that she actually got banned. Here, this is Ubu Cute Single talking about the ban. Hey guys, it's Ubu Cute Single here and recently I got terminated. But guess what? You know why? I actually did this to show the real face of Roblox YouTube. She trolled everybody. She took it down herself and then came back. Some of them just made a whole funeral of me. And you say that this person is verified on Roblox? Yeah, so then Alex actually talks about the funeral. Apparently, he hosted like a whole funeral party about the whole situation. I held a live funeral for Ubu Cute Single. And, uh, as a Jesus, of fact, <laughs> that's a lot of people. We actually celebrate this day because Ubu Cute Single is finally packed up and off. The YouTube platform! <laughs> Wait, there is more to the funeral? Wait, you, there's like a portal here? What the heck? Oh, this is, uh, this is very detailed. I think Alex has a lot of free time. And honestly, there's far worse Roblox YouTubers that should actually be banned. Let's see, what is Ooh Cute Single doing now? How to be a softy mommy. Yeah, you know what? Never mind. All right, but the next funeral that we have here is funeral for Adrian, my cat. Wait, is that the cat? Oh, that's so cute. Oh, this is actually quite nice. In loving memory of Adrian. Aw, that's wholesome. Look, you can even give little flowers. I like how they have all the cat toys right next to the gravestone. So this next funeral is actually based on a real person that unfortunately passed. The game is known as the Nerf Modder Museum. And I believe this is actually like a well-known Roblox player. He is considered by many to be the father figure of the modern military community due to his popularity and his top played games. But yeah, he unfortunately passed and the community made a whole memorial for him. Let's see, what do we have here? Nerf Modder's legacy has been built so those who knew and respected Nerf Modder and once remember him as he was will be able to access all his games he created. Forever thankful, Nerf Modder's mom. Oh, that's sweet. So she partook in this game creation as well. Okay, this is pretty wholesome. So it's like different members writing nice things about him. Nerf Modder was the coolest dude I ever met. I joined him in his game in 2011 and was very nice. And he was the first popular game creator I ever met in the game. Wow, there's like a lot of different messages. Dude, that's awesome. I'm sure his mom really appreciated all this. In honor of Nerf Modder, a great leader. Oh, is this fan art for him? Never touch my tacos. Why? Dude, even his cat made it in here. Poofy, Nerf Modder's cat. Dude, this is actually actually pretty cool. It's just different like images detailing things that he was passionate about. Oh no, Poofy died. Well, actually he lived a pretty long life. Before this video, I didn't really know about Nerf Modder, but he seemed to be really well loved. That's really awesome. All right, what other funerals are there? Oh yeah, I saw this one last time. Precraft's funeral. Yeah, apparently he was born in 1964. Okay. <laughs> I like how all the comments are just like, lol, lamal. <laughs> okay, fine. What's this one about? Oh, it's kind of like the same thing as uh, the other one. Dude, what is all this? Is this like a skull as well? <laughs> okay, what do we got here? Here. This is one of the gravestones. Oh yeah, check it out. Look at his bald, shiny head. I knew that thing was a wig. All right, what's in the chapel over here? Oh Jesus, creaking. <laughs> oh, he doesn't. Uh, he doesn't have a head. Where would it go? This is just his beanie and the rest of his body. This is kind of spooky, actually. <laughs> yeah, it's funny how there's a lot of funerals for a lot of different people who are still alive to this day. Like uh, we've got Mr. Beast's funeral here. Mr. Beast has died, and now you must attend his funeral. Okay, yes sir. What do we got here? Mr. Beast Burger. Oh, Mr. Beast Burger is actually now dead. Mr. Beast doesn't associate with them anymore. We've got a sad ah. Kevin the Cute from Fortnite. We've got Walter White. What the heck? <laughs> Why would they make this game? I know he's buried himself alive for like 50 hours and then seven days, which is just insane, actually. And I also do know that Mr. Beast has a crazy challenge when he dies. He said so himself. Take a look here. Tell him your plan for if you die. Oh, yeah. They want me to die. Oh, yeah. 100%. <laughs> Great video. Big time. They do. Because <laughs> the second I die, yeah. um, Carl... Chandler, Chris, the three guys, yeah, they yeah. all put their hand on my tombstone, last take it off, gets the channel. Everything. 100% wow. everything. His buddy's crying in front of his grave at hour 56. <laughs> That'll be a very interesting video to say the least. All right, this is a strange one, and I talked about it in my North Korea video. Even some of the supreme leaders of North Korea have their own funerals found in Roblox. Yeah, so it's like a whole recreation of like Pyongyang, the capital of North Korea. And uh, in this building here, which is an actual building, holds the tomb of two supreme leaders. So let's just go ahead inside the gates and yeah, 
here's one of the tombstones here and this roblox game only has one tomb and it's a little bit inaccurate because the actual tomb is actually see-through yeah that's right so it is the death and funeral of north korean leader kim il-sung this is from 1994 yeah you can see people bowing down to the body because if they don't then it's punishable possibly by death and yeah it's a glass tomb and it's pretty much mummified so it's still visible to this day like people can actually tour to see this the, the whole thing's honestly pretty bizarre north korea in general is a weird and absurd country uh but another funeral that we have here is rip the oof, oof sound because uh some people actually made a game about that hashtag save the oof. oof oh no they got the sad music here from 2006 to 2022 yeah rest in peace oof, oof sound <laughs> yeah for those of you who don't know the oof sound was removed in 2022 after it was copyright stricken because it was actually taken from this video game known as messiah yeah, so the sound comes from the little Cupid baby thing. <laughs> yeah, that, that's literally it. That little streak is now just gone from the game and replaced with this sound instead. Oh yeah, it says here there was a subsequent legal dispute over the use of the oof sound, which led to a compensation agreement. Well, that's unfortunate. Rest in peace, oof sound. All right, but now we have another sad funeral, and that's one that belongs to Selena, the famous singer that unfortunately passed at a very young age. Oh yeah, the thumbnail is even like one of her real tombstones. Okay, so it's got some of her images here, and then also here's her gravestone. Jeff Hardy 5... Okay, I don't know what that is, but uh, yeah, this image here is actually her tomb, I believe. Let's see. Oh yeah, that's right. And look, it's even gated as well, just like the Roblox game. For those of you who don't know who Selena was, she was a very popular singer who unfortunately passed due to one of her closest friends and president of her fan club. I won't go into the full details, but it is a pretty sad and horrific story. A and yeah, she did get life in prison for this. All right, this is a pretty interesting one. We've got the Game Theorist Funeral Countdown. So uh, I guess somebody actually made like a countdown timer for when Game Theorist, aka Matt Pat, is going to stop making videos because uh, he released a video a month ago saying that he was going to retire. It's not clickbait. On March 9th, I will be hosting my last theory episode, at which point I will be handing off the channels to someone else. All right, so we've got until March for MatPat. So let's see this game here. <laughs> here it is. That's just the theory, a game theory. Okay, he's got his Mario cap here. And I guess this is MatPat. This doesn't really look like him, but okay. <laughs> and then it's got like a lot of weird, crazy things around here. Got the Minecraft portal here, as well as like Princess Peach on fire in the background. <laughs> Very interesting game, but uh, I think it's pretty wholesome making something to remember Matt Pat's channel, Game Theorist. All right, but next we've got Cockroach Funeral, because that's actually a thing. The description says, pay respects to our dead friend. <laughs> what the heck? There's actually crying in this game? <laughs> Wait, this is pretty sad. Oh no, he's dead. Did the crying just makes it sad? I'm actually sad in this game. He's like in a little matchbox. What the heck is up there? Uh, I don't know if I'm supposed to see that. <laughs> I'm sorry, roach friends. Throw your roaches outside. Don't kill them. But yeah, if you guys like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Goodbye. <laughs>